How much can you receive in damages on an automobile, automobile accident? The, uh, the extent of damages uh, from an automobile accident will depend on, on the proof available on your damages. So what is the proof that you have for medical expenses? Uh, and that would include all the bills from the related providers and are all the providers that you sought treatment from, were they related? Were they medically necessary? Were those bills reasonable and necessary? Uh, the, or the charges. Um, the other element we've talked about is lost wages. Um, the extent of your lost wages, are they based on reasonable medical probability where you're restricted from work? Okay, and then what is the, the strength of proof of those lost wages? Do you have, uh, is it, are you an um, independent contractor, self-employed? Uh, is it just your word that you lost business or do you have a, a paycheck that shows uh, that you earn X amount and you've got a restriction that you missed work for uh, a period of time that where you can do that calculation fairly easily. So the, um, it's going to depend on the extent of those damages. Um, and then we talked about loss of, loss of household services um, and calculating those uh, where you either cannot provide a service or having to do without. And so what's the value of those services? For example, uh, lawn mowing, uh, cleaning your house, those sorts of duties um, or tasks. The, uh, the value of the other damages that are harder to calculate, that are more speculative, which would include your mental anguish, your pain and suffering, um, disability, disfigurement, uh, uh, physical impairment.